name is Sidharaj Khatavkar. I am studying at New Vision University, second sem. My name is Anjali Kumar and I am a student of New Vision University. Hey, myself Shraddha Mishra and I am studying in New Vision University, Tbilisi, Georgia. Hi, I am Ashmita from Chennai. I came here before three months. Mazanav Pranav Prakash Hake, Maharashtra Rajatun Sangli Jilatun Mi Aliloy. Hi everyone, I am Hemant from Mumbai, India. My name is Avesh Sayar. I have come here abroad for studying MBBS. My name is Akanksha. I am from Shurur. I am from Idhar. I am from New Vision University. My name is Urusa Deshmukh, studying in New Vision University. And I would like to share my personal experience with you as you are coming over here for studies. Already we have students from 25 countries. Among them, we have, of course, Indian students. They are majority at New Vision. In case of providing the highly standardized uh, education, we do have the uh, full professors as lecturers, and we are using the whole up-to-date information and up-to-date textbooks. At the same time, we are using the uh, laboratories for the practicals. It's interesting that from all programs which we offer here, medical degree program is the most popular one. It's same as in some other European countries or in India, MBBS. From entry perspective, this program is undergraduate, but from the perspective of graduation is equal to the master's level. That enables any international medical entrance exam, like MCI exam. You have a great campus, you have a good football ground for sportsmen. And this is our college, New Vision University campus. And here is a big library. Whichever book you want, you can come in the library and you will get it. If you are a shy person, like between the classes, you are very quiet. You can mail the teachers whatever doubts you have and they are always there to help you. We have one of the classes named as Audimax, which is an auditorium. Most of the big lectures, like main lectures, uh, happen there. We all study from the presentations and textbooks which are uploaded on our drives. We have our papers in MCQs, so and we have it on computers itself. You get your results as soon as you finish your test. You will have a daily analysis of how you're scoring, how you're doing, how you're studying and you need to do well every now and then uh, to be a great doctor. There are only two uh, medical universities in Georgia, to the State Medical University and the New Vision University, which these two universities, they have their own hospitals. That's why we choose the New Vision University Hospital because it gives us a lot of chance to develop like doctors. Today we started off with a lecture in electrocardiography. After that we saw how to do ECG. We practiced the practice on the patient. Uh, they are like teaching us every day how to perform an ECG correctly. He has no P waves. And what about RRE? It's equal or not? No, no, no. It's not equal. The patient had atrial fibrillation which was easily seen on the ECG. We were shown how to do blood analysis, how to use the equipment there. We checked, uh, we checked on some blood samples. We also did a microscopic examination. After we were shown how to interpret the results. Also, we were shown about uh, how to do mammographies, uh, which is very important for screening for uh, breast, breast cancer. Our students participate in teaching rounds in a night course uh, conference and learn clinical decision-making skills, good communication skills and also good interpersonal manner with colleagues and an empathy with patients. seven minutes for each operation if it's normal, it's not like this. 
hospital practice is very good. I think the best way to educate the doctors and these and also the postgraduate um, education also without hospital it's impossible to do that. No, not without but we have seen some surgeries for so patients where suffering from a serious issue like stomach cancer and liver cancer. We are going through the patients, they'll be helping us uh, how to solve the patient cases, how to diagnose the patient and what all the process we have to start. We always introduce new methodologies of teaching. That is, for the coming semester, 3D lecturing, including 3D library, and many other interesting novelties. The 3D lab helps students to fulfill the knowledge of the anatomy, to identify every and each region and structures of this region. It is very much important in a case of the molecular biology, biochemistry and histology to understand what are the molecules, what they are composed of and how they are giving you the composition of the cells and the tissues. We try to make educational process as affordable as possible. That's why for reasonably less tuition fee and accommodation costs, you will be able to get world-class education here in Georgia. The country is very beautiful. You will get a lot of views over here. Like you'll come, there will be many places to go out and see. Um, it's fun over here. It's also good, like not very cold in the winters and not very hot in the summers. You are able to easily suit with the climate. The people over here in this country are very helpful. They help you. You won't face any problems regarding the local. It's a very peaceful country. I mean, the crime rate is low. Girls are having uh, much safety here in Tbilisi. They are having good hostels here. Good hostel. So hostel is also good like you can see in our room which is provided by Kathano ma'am and uh, we have Indian mess, Indian cook where we can get varieties of food, breakfast, lunch, dinner, all are different. We get proper food, rice, dal, roti, sabzi, everything. You'll not feel like lonely, you'll feel like homely. You'll feel homely here. And every vacation we go to India. We miss India, but Georgia is very nice, so we don't miss India that much. As Georgia becomes an educational hub, our government launched a new program called Study in Georgia. In previous years, we had some problems, visa acquisition and entry to Georgia. This is eliminated now. You have to come here and see yourself why New Vision is different. We always tell students that they have two major obligations, to learn well and be happy.